Hello guys and welcome back to another video of Architects 3DP. As you may have seen in the title, and I already announced in previous videos, this is the presentation of a brand new project that finally arrived to the channel. I'm gonna make a full step-by-step -step guide to build your own DIY custom Prusa i3, based on the original Prusa i3 MK2S by Joseph Prusa, but this time using more affordable components that you can buy for very cheap while keeping a very good print quality. I am going to make a series with different episodes where you will learn step by step how to build each of the parts of your custom DIY 3D printer. But before starting, be sure to subscribe and to ring that bell to be notified when cool stuff is uploaded. If you do it, you will help me creating new content and growing the channel to reach more special viewers like you. For each episode of this series, I will upload the bill of materials with all the necessary components for each of the parts of the 3D printer. You will also find the links to buy all the necessary hardware through our Amazon affiliate links, as well as the tools we'll need in case you don't have them. For the 3D printed pieces, I will publish the link to download all the modified STL files, so you will be able to print them with your 3D printer. And in case you still don't have a 3D printer because this one is gonna be your first one, don't worry, you will be able to buy them from our website very soon, but for now you can contact me by email at architects3dp at gmail.com and I will give you a solution. Now I'm going to summarize all the necessary episodes you will need to complete to build your custom 3D printer, and they will be the next. The first one is this episode with the presentation of the project. In the episode number 2, we will build the y-axis structure. In the episode number 3, the y-axis movement. In the episode number 4, we will build the y-axis electronics and cable management. In the episode 5, the x-axis structure. 6, x-axis electronics and cable management. 7, z-axis frame preparation. 8, z-axis electronics and movement. 9, Z and X axis assembly and cable management. 10. X, Y and Z axis assembly where we'll have the structure complete. 11. Extruder preparation and assembly. 12. Extruder electronics, cable management and bridge assembly. 13. LCD assembly, installation and cable management. 14. Heated bed preparation and assembly. 15. Power supply preparation and assembly. 16 power supply installation and cable management, 17, main board installation and electronics, 18, Arduino coding and firmware upload 1 of 2, 19, Arduino coding and firmware upload 2 of 2, 20, first adjustments and calibrations, 21, Cura optimization and first quality prints. Those are the episodes I planned, and I will try to publish them regularly along the next weeks. Ok, so that has been more or less everything for this week's episode. I will let you with a couple shots of our custom Prusa i3 that I built in fluor green and I would like you to leave me a comment down below with your thoughts about this new project. Hit the like button if you liked the video and be sure to subscribe and to ring that bell to be notified when cool stuff is uploaded. Finally, I just wanted to give a special thanks to all of you and especially to our Patreon supporters that are slowly growing for continuing to make this channel possible. If you want to join them and support the channel as well, getting nice rewards and making me super happy, you can do it navigating to patreon.com slash architects through the beep or clicking here in the top right corner. Ok guys, so as always, see you in the next video.